Alright, what's going on everybody? My name is Dr. Rosilla and welcome back to another awesome video where today we are going to be reacting to the 71st Emmy nominations. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was weird. I don't know why I did that. Um, but I haven't seen these yet. Um, I actually was just scrolling around on YouTube and saw that these um, just happened. Um, and I didn't see them yet, so let's, I didn't see them, so let's watch Ken Jong and I forgot who, 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 I forgot who she is. Let's watch. I can almost feel this is going to be part one, by the way. Of, um, part two is going to be a very short video. Feel it too, Darcy. <laughs> Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Look at them. I skipped ahead because I saw that the nominations were just in front of this. Anyway. So, okay. Ready to get started? Let's do this. Let's right. just watch. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Okay. Our first category is lead actor in a limited series. I probably movie. haven't seen all of these. The better. nominees are Mahershala Ali, True Detective. Okay. Bill Hader and Barry is going to get nominated. Benicio right. Del Toro, Escape from Danamora. Okay. Hugh Grant, A Very English Scandal. Okay. Jared Harris, Chernobyl. Nice. Nice. Chernobyl. Good. Jarell Jerome, When They See Us. Didn't see that. I didn't see that. When and see Sam Rockwell, Fosse Verdon. What? These are the nominees for lead actor in a limited series. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, Jared Harris, I think, might win. Yeah. Um, wait, I won. thought, I thought, um, oh, Barry, I think, is uh, in like a, like a long-term running series. That's right. Okay. I got it. The nominees for lead actress in the limited series or movie are... Amy Adams, Sharp Objects. Nice. Amy Adams is good in that. I love Sharp Patricia Objects. Patricia Arquette, Escape at Danny Mora. Okay. See that. Anjanou Ellis, When They See Us. Joey King, The Act. <laughs> um, okay, I've, I, I've seen a little bit of The Act. Um, and Joey King is good in that. But I know Joey King from Slender Man. And guys, she's not good in that. That nobody, nobody is good in that. Nobody's good in Slender Man. It's just a stupid movie, but whatever. Joey King, sure. Good on it. Nisi Nash, When They See Us. Okay. And Michelle Williams, Fosse Verdon. Didn't see Fosse Verdon. These are the nominees for lead actress in a limited series or movie. Yeah! Amy Adams, I think, Woo! might win that. Because she's more famous. Well, she might not be, but the nominees for she's lead the one I've heard the most. In a comedy series are okay, Anthony Bill Hader. Anderson, Blackish. <laughs> okay, Anthony. Bill Hader is good. Don Cheadle, Black Monday. Don Cheadle. Yeah, Ted Danson, The Good Place. Good. Didn't finish Michael The Good Place. Michael Douglas, The Kaminsky Method. I didn't finish The Good Place. Got bored, actually. Bill Hader, Knew Barry. It. Yes. And Bill Eugene Hader. Levy, Schitt's Creek. Okay, didn't see Schitt's Creek. These are the nominees for lead actor in a comedy series. Cool. Cool. Very cool. Now for the nominees for lead actress in a comedy series. You know they say laughter is the best medicine? Ken, <laughs> don't not. interrupt medicine this. Medicine is the best medicine. Ha, you're a doctor, we get it. That is from my Netflix special, by the way, subscription Check only. Check it out. Now, Check it out. We're not sponsored by Netflix. We're on Netflix. Those... These are the nominees for lead actress in a comedy series. Christina Applegate, Dead to Me. So a little bit of that. Rachel Brosnahan, The Marvelous Mrs. Maisel. Nice, Marvelous Mrs. Maisel's good. Julia, we, Julia Louis Dreyfus, Veep. Ken, okay, don't listen to me. Haven't seen Veep. Natasha Leone, Russian Doll. Saw a trailer. Not Catherine O'Hara, Schitt's Creek. And Phoebe Waller Bridge, Fleabag. Okay. Rachel. These are the nominees for lead actress in a comedy series. Rachel Brosnahan should win that. No, she's Dang. really good in that. Plus, she plays a comedian in the show. That's a group. The nominees for lead actor in a drama series are Jason. Hold on, hold on. How? I mean, okay, that's good. That's good. Yeah. All right, lead Bateman actor. Ozark. Jason Bateman. Kit Harrington is going to get nominated. Sterling K. Brown, This Is Us. Watch for Kit Harrington. Kit Harrington. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> He's not going to win. This show sucks now. Bob Odenkirk, Better Call Saul. Yeah, but that sucks now. Billy Porter, Pose. Okay. 
And Milo Ventimiglia, this is us. Uh, the dude that looks like These Freddie are the nominees Mercury. for lead act. I want Kit Harrington to win just because he's really the only one I've ever been a legit fan of. Jason Bateman's good, and he's done some good work. And Sterling K. Brown is always the win. But I don't know. Kit might win because Game of Thrones has a great he uh, history. But, you know, I wouldn't put it past Jason. Or any of the people from This series. Is Us. Yeah! The nominees for lead actress in a drama series are Amelia LeClark, Game of Thrones. Okay, she's not going to win. I know that. Jodie Comer, Killing Eve. Okay. Viola Davis, How to Get Away with Murder. Yeah. yeah. Laura Linney, Ozark. Oh, nice. She's good enough. Mandy Moore, This Is Us. Okay. Sandra O, oh, nice. Killing Eve. <laughs> yeah, Sandra's good. Sandra's and good. Robin Wright, House of Cards. Okay, okay. These Robin are Wright, the nominees. Robin Wright has a chance with that. Um, San Amelia Clark does not. If, if it were any of the years, she, she would. But here, it's either Sandra O, oh, um, Laura, Lenny, or, or maybe Robin Wright. For lead actress in a drama series. I know that. Yeah, that's right. Here are this year's nominees for Outstanding Competition Program. Okay. The Amazing Race. American Ninja Warrior. All right, nice. That's good. Nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> what? RuPaul's Drag <laughs> Race. Okay. RuPaul. I have a friend that Top watches that. Top Chef. Don't watch it. And The Voice. I don't watch that either. These are the nominees. Wow. Nailed it got nominated. I love Nailed It. Netflix is Netflix for the win. For outstanding. Still get to nominate Stranger Things, though. And I'm a little Standing concerned about that. Program. I'm a little concerned about that. Thank you, Ken. The nominees for Outstanding Variety Talk Series are The Daily Show with Trevor Noah. Okay, Trevor's good. Full Frontal with Samantha B. Never heard of it. Jimmy Kimmel Live. Nice, Jimmy. Jimmy, like Jimmy. Last Week Tonight with John Oliver. Okay. The Late Late Show with James uh -huh. Corden. Nice, James. James got on there. And The Late Show with Stephen Colbert. Okay, Colbert might win. These um, are the nominees for Outstanding Variety Trevor might win, uh, but I know there's definitely a chance of Jimmy, James, um, Jimmy, James Corden, or Stephen Colbert. The nominees yeah. for Outstanding Television Movie are Bandersnatch. Yes! Yes! Nice! Brexit. Oh, how did Bandersnatch? Yes! Deadwood. I want to watch Deadwood. I haven't seen it. I want to watch that film. King Lear and My Dinner with Hervé. These are the nominees. How did Bandersnatch get nominated? That okay. I I'm a big fan of Bandersnatch. I'm gonna do a video where I talk about Bandersnatch soon. But oh my gosh, Bandersnatch is so unique. Just the way you can it's a choose your own adventure movie and it's on Netflix. That's insane. Bandersnatch has to win this. It'd be such it'd be such a historic moment for the Emmys. Just for outstanding television. Movie. I did not expect that. Woohoo! Woohoo is an, yeah. isn't yeah. Woohoo yeah. is right. Nice. For outstanding limited series. Oh no, second one second. How oh, long am I to this? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut it off now. We're gonna pick it up back in part two. I'm excited to I'm excited for this. I, I really do wanna see. However, I hope Strange Things gets a nomination. It's concerning. Well, you'll see me in just a second. Bye.